Hello everybody, I hope you're all doing very well and welcome back to another cryptocurrency technical analysis where in today's video, of course, <laughs> we're going to be going through Bitcoin, the one and only Bitcoin that has moved up substantially again today. Obviously, really, we're talking about since the 29th of April where we have just seen the continuous higher highs, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, and you know the story, continuous higher highs and higher lows, making trading this extremely easy easy okay if you have been finding this hard you have been over complicating the chart it has been very very simple to be trading this if i'm honest um <clears throat> obviously i want to remove these patterns for you all a second to declutter this chart decluttering decluttering okay cool right really simply now we're just left with our fibonacci channel okay let's go up a time frame okay 45 minute chart we can see clearly now in this Fibonacci channel that we've been covering now for I don't know how many days, uh, like weeks really, we've obviously been looking at the low point and then up to the one point. So the overall target for the top of this this channel, still the target is going to be, we're on, on about here, we're looking at bit, bit Binance, uh, Binance, okay, so we're looking at Binance, obviously around this 5,900 region for a top target, obviously on situation between which exchange you're looking at, obviously, oh, one second please, I have to take this call. Sorry about that. I was literally on hold for about 35 minutes and it finally got answered. And uh, yeah, just as I start the technical analysis, typical. But now I'm back about, I don't know how much longer after, but uh, kind of lost where I was. Um, so here we are anyway, looking at Bitfinex, Bitmex here. So on the Bitmex chart, uh, we can just clearly see how from breaking up from this parallel channel, okay? Uh, I can't even remember if I covered this now, but uh, <laughs> we were obviously looking at the parallel channel, okay? So this parallel channel that you break up from, okay? Break up from the parallel channel, retest that parallel channel, okay? So that was a retest, break from the parallel, retest of the parallel channel. That is giving you an amazing long entry, to be honest. And from that uh, from that long entry, you are currently sat at around a 9% gain, okay? And there's still no reason to close it out because you just see these higher higher lows higher highs higher lows higher highs higher lows higher highs another higher low so really you're looking down to on these smaller term time frames now to get a better idea of what is going on right now so let's zoom down to a lower term time frame the 10 minute chart okay and draw what could be happening right now so i really see this live happening a potential symmetrical triangle yeah so a symmetrical triangle that we can see right here um so yeah i would see something like this obviously if you break down from this trend line support then you're looking at a a um, descending triangle <laughs> um so either way we're looking at a continuation pattern so that's really where you want to be looking at this short-term support okay so we're looking at support on the bitmex chart here of 5653 okay 5653 key support and we're looking at resistance 5769 okay those are the two key levels that obviously if we do not break out of those triangles then we can be looking at a parallel channel going sideways okay so that's what i will literally be uh, looking at and trading from over the next few hours to come going into the night and for me the daily close is extremely important if the daily close is above 5653 then that is healthy and this move can continue to the upside okay the upside we are clearly finding massive resistance massive 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 5800 no no uh, ignore all this section that is educational content right there um but yeah we're clearly finding key resistance on 5800 why because we obviously had massive support 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 all of that support that held up throughout 2018 flips into resistance what a surprise we got rejected first time not um so yeah that's what we were looking at first uh firstly okay that rejection then the pullback then the long from the pullback and then we're holding the higher lows and now we're obviously reaching those smaller smaller equilibriums uh and we're going to get you know probably might maybe by the time i've uploaded this video we could have had a break from this range, but kind of unlikely. I would expect this to cool off a little bit and uh, trap a few more uh, traders <laughs> before we get our big move. Um, so obviously, I'm already in a position, but if you are not in a position, then you want to see uh, whether this, you know, breaks to the downside or the upside, really. Um, okay. Obviously, some of the alts that have been moving the highest today, obviously, B BCH has moved quite well in terms of Sculpin and obviously Litecoin. Yeah, what a coin Litecoin has been. Uh, we've obviously been looking at Komodo with some nice gains today. Um, there's some other alts, but mainly I've been concentrating on Bitcoin, to be honest, because I love trading Bitcoin when it has is the highest mover. It's, it's you know, there's no need to focus on the other alts when you can be uh, <laughs> leverage trading Bitcoin. It's, it's absolutely brilliant. But yeah, really, this was just a really quick 
update video for you all today of the levels to be watching and you really do want to be watching this 5653 uh 5769 and as we're speaking we're obviously coming down to test this support level so i do, do kind of want to get back in and start trading this right now um and if we obviously break down the next level i'm looking at is 5590 okay um you can see here how we're trying to hold a double bottom but um yeah let's just see how this goes i'm looking down if 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 we break down then you're looking at 5590 obviously that being a support level and then you see here how it flipped into uh resistance and then we lost it hold it old resistance into support moved up for another leg okay so that's what we're looking for now for the potential of this other leg if these key support levels do in fact hold okay so yeah a really quick video today but uh yeah i hope you appreciate that i am in the middle of trading this right now so it does have to be kind of quick um i just hope that you have all stayed safe in altcoins uh obviously oh, there we go there's a break and there is a break right now okay i really am wanting to go and trade this now because this is important so i am going to uh leave this video i'll be keeping my eye on this support and i'll be taking a scot from that right now so uh hope you've hope you've enjoyed this video and i will catch you in the next one uh let's go trade this cheers <laughs>